Monique and I have had our share of differences for sure. You don't have a home? I have four homes. You don't act like you want to be here anyway. So just leave. But hell has frozen over because I'm sick of fighting with this girl. Let's see if we can kiki, put everything on the table, and move forward. You know, I don't think that we've ever, like, really just trusted each other. And I feel like, I don't know if it's on both sides, but every time I hear Giselle, I automatically just assume the worst. I always hate your honesty. But it doesn't make any sense to me. I feel like, no, we need to be able to sit down and kiki and, like, have a good time. I don't think we've ever had any issues so <laughs> crazy that we can't recover. Right. It's about time Giselle stop acting like a bottom behind trick and wants to be nice and try to make up and move forward. Look, I've always said that Giselle is much easier to get along with when she's getting steady D. Well, she done took it to another level because she's getting that anointed D. Power to the D. <laughs> so are we good? No, I'm glad that we're, we're having this open dialogue. We both love Ashley, so I think that's like the perfect connection right there. Now, how is Ashley? Because I've been watching her Instagram. Mm -hmm. And some of her stories, she's like sad and depressed. <sighs> um, I feel been falling into a little bit of a slump. And this is just me being completely candid. She's taking it to a whole nother level. Like she doesn't <laughs> want to leave the house. I said, listen, girl, you can only control what you can control. You gotta live your life. Right. But I think we can do something for Ashley together. I was thinking a dinner or something. I think a dinner would be great. Mm -hmm. uh, maybe we come up with a theme. Uh, coming out the house party. I like it. Okay. Look at me and Monique working together. Let's do it.